Thanks, Dean. Time for Ron Tom. Hey, Anna. All right, let's meet this woman that has broken a record for owning um, the most or the largest collection of hand sewn or handmade sock monkeys in the world. Her name is Arlene Oaken. Arlene, not only do you own the, co the collection, you built a museum. Good morning. Good morning, Anna. All right, how did you end up? You didn't have one as a child. This happened as an adult? Right. Okay, tell me the story about your first one. Okay, 17 years ago, my mm -hmm. husband and I were in an RV traveling the country, and we stopped at a Cracker Barrel, and um, he bought me my first one right here, this guy, mm -hmm. um, named Sock Monkey. Yeah. Um, and so um, he became our mascot as we traveled. And we put him in pictures, like by the biggest ball of twine yeah. and that kind of thing. Um, and then I researched and I looked into the history and I found out it was tied to um, Americana. Uh -huh. And um, to Illinois, actually, yeah. because the socks they're made from came from Rockford. And so you started going on eBay. Over here, you were telling me that you may have gotten the first one of a set and then found the twin somewhere else, and then you tur yes. turned out to be triplets. Yes, through collecting, mm -hmm. um, I find, I call these my soulmates because they're made for each other. Yeah. Um, and sometimes I get monkeys that match ones that I already have. So we just keep kind of reuniting the families back together. When you start the museum, you know, it's kind of, you, you see the humor in it too. So you kind of have the story of socks as well. But people, I've never had a sock monkey. You also have interactives, Definitely. like in a real museum. Yes. So you, they were filled with rice and rags and whatever they could find during the war. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. Sawdust does not make a very soft, cuddly monkey, yeah. but they used whatever they had. What fascinated you about this toy? Um, you know what? They're just adorable, and um, I just, who doesn't love sock monkeys, right? They're smiling back at you. Yeah. What's in here? Um, well, so that room we were in was history, and this yeah. is more like pop culture. Right. Why we still love our sock monkeys today. So this mm -hmm. is kind of my barrel of monkeys wall. I love it. Um, and just kind of brings it up till today. Um, we have our sockumentary in the other room. I know. Are you open every day? We're open Thursday through Sunday. And there's right a now. retail space and also a spot where you can make, you can build your own sock monkey. We'll see that coming Absolutely. up around town from Long Grove.